Businesses throughout NEPA are preparing for one of their busiest seasons, Easter. And time is running out with Easter now just a few days away. Today, Fox 56's Jake Sarwar took on the sweet assignment of finding out how they're getting ready for the big day. With Easter falling in March this year, the holiday season seems to have arrived earlier than usual. Small businesses throughout NEPA have been preparing for Sunday, including John L. Stope Candies and Plains. Walking in, you'll immediately spot chocolate-covered pretzels, their famous peanut butter chiffons, and of course, the popular chocolate bunnies. For decades, there's always been a traditional solid bunny in every single basket and a solid cross. They're just staples. Manager Joshua Mulcahy says Easter is their busiest time of year, and they recently made changes in production to keep up. At one time, we had over 250 molds. Um, we downsized in the recent years um, just because we can't keep up with the demand. Um, but we put our heart and soul in all the pieces we do. Still, Stope offers something for every occasion, all while keeping their business local, something Manuka Pastry Shop in Scranton believes in. It's almost family tradition for the generations, you know, different generations to come in. And I think there's a lot of nostalgia built into that. Bob Zakreski is a co-owner of the shop and has been hard at work preparing for an Easter favorite, Pasca bread. Most cultures have some sort of holiday bread that comes in different forms. So we make a round raisin. Zakreski says Pasca bread is a big seller during Easter. It's a little different than traditional bread. It's, it's sweeter, it has eggs and sugar, things that you wouldn't normally see in typical white bread. In addition to Pasca, Manuka offers other goodies like cakes, peanut butter eggs, and cookies that are decorated with bunnies and lambs. Here at Manuka and even at John Stope, they're going to be open leading up to Easter, so there's still plenty of time to come on out and get your favorite sweet treats. In Scranton, I'm Jake Sarwar, Fox 56 News, first at 10. Looks good. For more information about the businesses, including their hours leading up to Easter, you can visit this story at fox56.com.